Hey YouTuber, so I just ran the user benchmark again for the Dell Vostro 3470. Hopefully I got that model number right. And uh, some improvement overall. Um, gaming still tanking. Desktop has gone up and workstation went up. Um, you'll see over here I'm just going to move the camera closer so we are now in the uh, 80 percentile of uh, PCs in this class by upgrading the RAM so all the people that have reported their statistics I guess through user benchmark uh, they either have added more RAM replaced their hard drive with an SSD or have somehow put a graphics card in this thing. It's the only ways I would think they could do better. Um, you know, if you had 16 gigs of RAM or something higher, then it, it would obviously give you a little better score here, and they, they would score higher. But, uh, you know, uh, it was definitely a good idea to add the RAM. That was a big-time weakness. There are some things uh, running on this computer that I have I've noticed um, doing a controlled out delete going to the task manager that are you know helping to slow this thing down and I'm gonna figure out how to pretty much kill those completely um, you can end task on them and uh, it helps but uh, I want a, a permanent fix so we'll take care of that now um, that said you know this thing's not too bad um, I'm honestly starting to wonder though if my Intel uh, i3 7100 desktop that I built actually was a better machine. It has the uh, 7th gen uh, motherboard and um, so I think Intel it's the 630 HD not the UHD like this one uh, and I I got better scores out of it um, and it only had 8 gigs of RAM in it. Matter of fact the 8 gigs of RAM that I added to this one is from that, that PC as it sits on the floor um, waiting for some love. See there I'm going to part that out on eBay or I will um, rebuild it as an i5 or an i7. Um, probably skip over i5 and go to the i7 at some point when those chips become more affordable but yeah that's that's that with this uh, I have not played any games on it I have not done any um, video editing on it yet, and I have not done any um, Autodesk in a, any kind of AutoCAD or uh, Inventor on it so uh, I have to transfer my license over to this computer from the old one. And uh, we'll see how that goes. Um, I'm starting to wonder about this one, but, uh, you know, it's uh, for the price I paid for it, not too bad. $249 ship, no taxes that I can recall. Um, so overall, pretty happy. Thanks for checking out my video. Please like, please subscribe.